Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to make a rice with pigeon peas or arroz con gandules outside. And I'm going to be using my camp chef in here. So stay tuned if you want to see how I'm going to make this delicious recipe. Yo te traigo esta bomba. Esta bomba puertorriqueña. Okay. The first thing I'm going to do is to turn on the Camp Chef stove. Um, I already opened the um, the gas, and then I'm going to just press it that um, press it, and then put it in warm, and turn on. I'm using the caldero or the aluminum pot to make the rice. And I have it in here. I'm just going to put a little bit of oil. Any type of oil is fine. I'm using corn oil. And I don't, I'm going to leave all the ingredients in the description box below. In this container, I have sofrito and recaito. It's like a half cup of that. If you don't have recaito, you can use sofrito. And what is sofrito? Sofrito is peppers, onion, fresh garlic, cilantro, or recao, or culantro. Uh, put it in the blender and blend it real well. So that's like a half cup. And then I'm going to um, just saute this for one minute or two. Now I'm using one tablespoon of garlic paste. And I'm using half a um, can of the agandules or the pigeon piece with the water, but you also can use the whole can, the small one, with the water. This is one envelope of sazon, that's called color. If you don't want to use that because the uh, MSG, you can use a paprika, one tablespoon, a, or to two tablespoons. I'm using two envelopes, so you can use two tablespoons of the uh, paprika. I'm also going to use one a envelope of the ham flavor. And if you don't eat pork, a, you can use chicken bouillon or the vegetable bouillon. And here I have five cups of water because I'm going to make four cups of rice. And the rice I'm going to use is the long grain. I'm going to use approximately two tablespoons of salt. And like I said, it's to your taste. You can taste the uh, taste of the water and adding little by little. Now I'm going to use some oregano. It's like a one tablespoon of oregano, but I'm using the palm of my hand to measure. You're going to stir. And now we're going to let this water to come to a boil. I want to mention I do not rinse my rice. But if you want to do it, it you can do it. Rinse it with water and then drain the water real good. Now the water is boiling and we're going to add the rice. I'm adding four cups of long grain rice. And the heat is a medium. We're going to stir the rice and then we're going to cook the rice for only a few minutes until the water evaporates. After the water evaporates, we're going to lower the heat, we're going to cover it, and we're going to continue um, cooking. Okay. Now 
we're gonna cover it, we're gonna lower the heat, and we're gonna let this rice to cook for approximately 20 minutes. I'm going to stir from the bottom to the to the to the top. Make sure you use the pot holder. As you see, you move it from the from the bottom to the top. And to this right, you can add some olive, you can add some fresh cilantro, you can add um, ham cut in small pieces. So we're gonna do different versions, but this is the um, simple one. So after that, we're gonna cover the rice and we're gonna let it cook for 10 more minutes and done. So after 10 more minutes, you can serve your rice with whatever you want. So I hope you guys like this video. Remember to subscribe and share.